I have to mark this occasion because this occasion is the first day in my life that I've been banned from Facebook. <laughs> I've been on Facebook for, I think, 12 years. Thirteen, twelve, thirteen years, thirteen, fourteen years. It's either it's two thousand and eight or two thousand and seven, so it's thirteen or fourteen years. I've been on Facebook, and today is the first day that I got banned. And why did I get banned? Because I'd posted a video, um, saying anger as COVID dancers defy lockdown in snowy city park basically in leicester we've been in lockdown since march of last year with leicester is just they hate us for fucking shawadi wadi right they will not forgive us for shawadi fucking wadi give me a second all righty just one sec um they will not like literally they hate leicester right for some fucking reason be it smallpox, because we were the ones who denied the vaccine and didn't get smallpox. Who knows? But Leicester has been locked down city central for almost a year. And basically now, like, and, and I still, I, I know nobody, I know of nobody who's actually died genuinely of COVID, of COVID, never mind within 28 days of a positive test, you know, like, I know if, I know if somebody who had a ma massive car accident and died of COVID, I know if somebody, my ex is Nuaf, it's okay, he is Nuaf, like, his, his wife, who's a very good friend of mine, um, she, her mother died of old age and many pre-existing health conditions and she was put down of COVID. They're the only two people that I know that have died of COVID, with COVID. And they, the government are even saying now, with COVID, within 28 days of a positive test. That does not mean that's what killed you. Right. Anyways, I posted this thing. It was it was people being happy in a park in the snow. Lots of people dancing around and singing. So I was like, oh, my God, this is so nice to see humans being human without being afraid of being human. Like literally, they're just having fun. They're in the fresh fucking air, for God's sake. Nobody is in danger. And this guy decided he was going to attack me. And attack me, he did. And he attacked me and carried on attacking me. And I came back at him. He's basically accused me. He's like Brighton Hospital's full up with people with it. Because I, I was like, look, you know, like they don't mention how having a positive mental attitude actually does help. There are numerous scientific papers on this to say if you are positive in yourself, positive energy breeds positive health. That is a thing. And he's like, no, like my best mate, Anthony, happens to live in Brighton. She's not heard any of this that he's going on about, right? He's like positive or negative has little to do with it. Then we got into this big old beef about disabilities and stuff he has autism i've got multiple sclerosis he's like he came at me in the end with a like um uh oh my god so you are well, not in the end oh my god so you are not disabled and having a go at me for being disabled that's really evil i'm evil because i'm not disabled multiple sclerosis is not a disability. Um, and literally, this is this is the level of mentality of the guy that I was dealing with. But basically, he's, he's, 
he's reported me and I've been blocked on Facebook. So I've got my first ban because this guy who basically believes the official narrative and says, no, I heard this on the TV. Fuck you and your new age fucking Namby Pamby Fandango. You can't heal anything with positive thinking. He, he just got me deplatformed on Facebook for 20, it's only 24 hours. But it was enough to make me put some makeup on and do a YouTube video. So fucking comment me, mate. If you strike me down, oh, <laughs> don't make me Obi Wan Kenobi. I literally, literally, this man. I've, I've, I actually blocked him in the end. I don't block people. I deleted him as friend, I unfriended him and then I pointed out, well, I've already unfriended you, what are you going on for? And then at the end, it's like, nah, I'm blocking you because you've just had me banned. I ain't having you in my world. I am not having that person in my world. I would never, ever report someone unless they were paedophilic. If you come at the kids... Cracking, mate. I will fucking take you down. I will take you down. Facebook won't, like, because Facebook, they don't do anything about that. But I will. I will fucking take you down and I'll report you and everybody else will report you on Facebook. Won't Nothing will happen. But if you say to somebody that's saying you're attacking me for having autism... When you don't have a disability, when I've got multiple sclerosis, you notice that I'm never walking around when I'm making my videos. When have you ever seen me making a video when I'm walking around? That's because I have multiple sclerosis. Do I fucking go around saying, I've got multiple sclerosis, feel sorry for me? No, I don't, mate. This guy, I've got autism. I also ride around on a fucking motorbike and sell aloe vera that I've grown in my back garden. And I also am selling my artwork that I can, that I'm painting. And I've got my, my benefits to make this great big fucking setup of a camera that makes it so that you can see my artwork. And I'm selling that artwork. Do I have anything I can sell? No, because my hands don't work and my legs don't either. So him saying that I'm being rude and that I don't have a disability and he fucking does is him being fucking rude. And I'm sorry, but I don't, I don't make a big thing about being disabled. I just sit in a chair. You know what I mean? I don't, nobody needs to know that my legs don't work. Nobody needs to know this fucking shit. But that twat, that twat decided that he was going to fucking bring me down and make it out that I don't fucking deserve anything. And he could just pull 24 hours of your life, mate. Oh, heaven forbid, you can fucking, this donkey land, fucking heaven forbid, you can have a go at a bloke that's riding round on his fucking motorbike and claiming massive amounts of bib on both. I'm so sorry. I shouldn't have said his, well, it's not his name. It's, a, it's not his name. He didn't like that for the longest time. His name on Facebook wasn't his name. That was, he's only just put, he's changed it to his, not only just. I've been mates with him for fucking years. Mates with him for years. And he decides, he, does he ever post on anything? Does he ever comment on anything that I ever say? No, he fucking doesn't. He chooses this one thing because this one thing, he decides, oh, excuse me, but I've seen this thing on the telly. 
and I know better than you. And then he decided to call me an idiot and it went fucking downhill from there. So, yes, I do apologise. I went below the belt. I did. Did I say something that I think denied me my Facebook account? No, I didn't. I pointed out actual things that he's actually said. That's what got my Facebook taken down. It's only 24 hours, but at the end of the day, when you've got 24 hours to kill, what do you do? You make a YouTube video, right? If you shut me down in one fucking avenue, I will pop up in, pop up in another fucking two. Chop one head off the beast, mate. I will grow two more. Fucking bring it on. If you want to be like donkey land, fucking bring it on. Bring it on. Because at the end of the day, I have shitloads of friends on my friends list who are fucking amazing human beings who will have my back no matter what. And you know what? They won't have my back because I tell them that they have to. It's because they know that I'm a good person. This man is a twat. He got himself blocked at the end. I don't block anybody. I blocked this man. I blocked him, literally. Well, because he got me blocked. What can you do? He fucking shut me up on Facebook. Um, he now has nothing to do with my fucking life. Fuck off, you twat.